Hello guys, Wizards here bringing you another Total War Warhammer replay with commentary for today's battle. We are playing as Kislev, who is being uh, led by an ice witch with the uh, lore of ice hiding in the forest somewhere. And we're going against Zarina Catherine with his patriarch, uh, both of them sitting on the war bear. So this was a really fun battle. I hope you guys enjoy it. So let's just talk about the armies before the lines meet. Uh, the first shot has gone in. We'll see how it does uh, in a second. But for my army, we have two armored corsairs in the front line, two corsairs with spear, and two zargards with great weapons, which which are pretty nice in this battle. Uh, we also have two strelzi again armor piercing, good against Kislev. A little Grom here. And that's not all. We already have seen in my previous uh, videos how Snow Leopards perform in this matchup. So, uh, not in this matchup, but overall. So, we have two of them, and we have two light uh, war sleds as well, which you should always bring uh, because they're broken. So, for my caster, let's see the spells here before we get to the other side. Um, as you guys. I don't know if you guys saw or not, but we have a Guardian Call Summon here, which ha which is a Snow Leopard with Guardian ability. Uh, we have Snowflakes Pendant for some Winds of Magic Regeneration, Death Frost, Heart of Winter, and I think that's it, Arcane Conduit and Iron Ice Armor, which is pretty nice item as well. So for my opponent, we have three Light War Slits, uh, three Armored Corsars, one as our guard and one Strail C, my opponent went for two cab units, one winged lancers with two chevrons and a griffin legion. Uh, for Catherine, let's see, we have the stand your ground, forest fang, a uh, frost fang, I mean, a uh, uh, frost blades, death frost, everything frost, heart of winter, uh, and uh, the item, the rope, ice rope, or what, uh, the crystal clock, and I think that's it. For the Patriarch, we have just uh, Balalaika of the Arari and Sli uh, Sa Sal Saliak Slalabai, which heals. So, guess that's it. Uh, let's just uh, start a battle in normal speed. My cannon is gonna shoot in a minute. I didn't want you guys to miss it and uh, how well it does in this matchup. The cannon is going. And it does a devastating amount of damage, killing one of the warslets just like that, which is pretty nice there. So what I'm trying to do here, I'm trying to be in in a radius of one of the uh, warslets uh, and keep my two warslets uh, close enough and do damage there. And that's why I'm doing decent amount of damage here. And uh, let's just uh, go to the other side of the battle. My snow. We, I mean, Snow Leopards are going after the Wing Lancers, the Ice Witch is going to go after the Griffin Legion, and she's probably gonna uh, uh, summon her um, Snow Leopard as well. Right here, my opponent doing a really great job going after the um, uh, War Slits here, but look at that insane cannon fire. That just killed 12 models, and we have our Snow Leopard here. Ice Witch already uh, charged in and with her item, the ice, Iron Ice Armor, these guys have 26 melee attack, which is pretty bad uh, considering we have 38 melee defense ourselves and with the Guardian here and as soon as I send uh, the uh, Snow Leopard here, yeah, these guys are done. The cannon is shooting as well. So uh, on the left flanks, unfortunately, we have lost are two units one zargard and one Kosars with spear but in return we were able to do a lot of damage to these um, war slits here the strelzi hiding in the forest shooting the uh, the slits here doing a lot of damage my opponent is using this uh, her spells uh, katherine is using aoe spells this is the item going down that did a lot of damage there so uh, yeah this unit is done as well, so we lost three of our units, uh, but um, I kept my two range units apart, so I can do 
the damage while not taking a lot in return here uh, the slits have taken a lot of damage I did a really good there uh, giving myself uh, some pat uh, patting on the back here but yeah uh, the war slits are pretty damaged I'm sending in the caster and two war slits trying to do some damage holding them from getting into my other strelc uh, which I uh, which are really important here I really need them to uh, get rid of the czar guard here on the infantry front we were able to do decent amount of damage the calves one of them is gone the uh, griffin legion is here but i have to finish them off that's why i'm sending one of the snow leopards here the other ones are gonna go after zarina and the patriarch uh zargard on the right flank did really great the left flank unfortunately got a uh, road over uh, by the war slits uh, the strelsi were getting a lot of uh, clear shots at my uh, slits i was trying to force back them to go after the strelsi i used the uh, the heart of winter as well to do some damage while uh, the uh, my war slits get um, disjointed from my opponent fortunately we were able to break one of the great uh, griffin legions the strelsi also were able to hold enough while my other range units dealt with the czar guard but uh, this at this part uh, my war slits got wrecked as well my opponent war slits uh, were still able to fight a bit and with the armor piercing from patriarch and catherine on top of their bears yeah they did their damage uh, so catherine uses uh, death frost on my uh, caster the ice witch but uh, one of the great things about her first of all she has more speed than the bears I think um, even even if she doesn't she has her armor which reduces melee speed by 10% that means the patriarch and Catherine can catch up to her I also have a death frost here so I'm just gonna cast it here uh, it's not gonna slow unfortunately but yeah I don't think Catherine is going to be able to catch me and uh, the snow leopard is here to uh, deal with her as well the other snow leopard was going after the sleds which uh, which it uh, did its job so they're just gonna chase Catherine and try to finish her off um, patriarch was pretty close to capturing ice witch but yeah I just uh, drove in through my own units and with that uh, the patriarch is stuck and the two really fast moving snow leopards are gonna finish Catherine off in, in a second now yeah two more attacks and she's gone the strelsi also no slouches in melee so yeah we held her down and finished her off uh, the cannon also got a decent amount of kill uh, for 900 uh, damage dealt and i was trying to hit the uh, patriarch but i don't think we're, we're gonna need that and uh, if you take an overlook of the battlefield we were able to clean most of my opponent's units, the infantry are gone, the Yitzhar guard are going to deal with the armor cutters, and yeah, um, Catherine gone, Patriarch also uh, lost the will to fight. Pretty fun battle, and yeah, it was a, a pretty <laughs> fun civil war in uh, Kislev, and we were able to be victorious. So this was a pretty fun army. We, uh, my opponent did have uh, some of my ideas but yeah i went uh, more all in on them and uh, i got rewarded so let's see uh, 1600 nearly 1700 damage value uh, on the ice switch pretty nice uh, the spells were great the cannon did great you guys saw there I put a pressure on my opponent and it had a lot of hp it still ca could have fought in melee zargard doing okay the other one unfortunately not so much but yeah the other one could have gone uh, for more as well. The uh, armored cutters did okay. Strelsi, um, have to say, uh, the the one from the forest did really great. The other one, full HP, kinda. The um, war sleds also did fine. And look at this. These snow leopards always pay for uh, for themselves, at least for me. Uh, Seventeen hundred, nearly eighteen hundred. The other one, twelve hundred. Both of them paying for themselves uh, twice fold and uh, and then some so yeah pretty ab happy about that because is doing fine as well catherine doing okay but i don't think any of these units were able to pay for themselves maybe the war sleds yeah one of them did fine uh this did okay 
the armor clusters, not so much. So yeah, uh, this was the game by the way that I realized the uh, summon snow leopard give guardian aura and I made a video about it. Uh, you guys can uh, see it at the end of the end of this video and guess that's it i uh, hope you guys enjoyed it if you did i would really appreciate it if you guys consider leaving a like and subscribing it would really help me and my channel grow i also have a discord server if you guys want to send me replays if you guys want to talk chat you can find the link uh, to in the description of this video so that's it catch you later